Hi everybody, um, my name is Peter and welcome to our cabin tour 8154 on the port side of Anthem of the Seas. So on entry to the cabin, the doors open outward to give you a bit more room. And as soon as you come in on uh, your left hand side, you'll find the control for air conditioning, uh, which automatically switches off every time the balcony door is open. So that has to be locked. Uh, key slot for the main power and then the main power light. You've got a full length mirror to your right hand side. Um, those hooks aren't included, they're ours. Yeah, we had to use three <laughs> to keep the, uh, the coats up and uh, they kept sliding to the floor otherwise. So as you come into the cabin, it gives you a bit more feeling of space because the uh, bathroom door is angled. Um, so we'll start in the bathroom if that's okay. So again, um, you can see in there standard in terms of shelving, um, wash hand basin, shelving underneath, the toilet itself obviously, and a nice size uh, shower with glass door. Plenty of hooks for um, towels and dressing gowns. And again, one, one factor of this is when the light is off during the night, you've got basically a night light. So no falling into the bathroom. <laughs> Unless you're drunk. Yeah, okay, we'll not do that one. So, um, as you can see, you've got a sofa there. Now this is only a cabin for two people, so it's not a bed, um, a pull out bed or anything like that. Um, you've got your wardrobes on either side. This first one uh, is quite deep and it's quite weird. It's got an angle to it, so it's very deep and it's got two hanging rails. Okay. And then the next one is more of a smaller one, um, but that has got drawers at the bottom, whereas the other one doesn't. And again, this houses a set of shelves, um, you're safe, <clears throat> and then a very small hanging area. And as you can see, we bring like a hanging, um, Thing for shoes save having them all over the floor hooks inside the wardrobe so you could potentially put some coats in there okay so working back down this end on the right hand side you've got your desk area with chair big over uh, big circular mirror and your power points here are you've got a european two pin two usbs and two American style sockets. And as found on, we found earlier this year, getting very much now where you can actually move the table out. So if you're having room service, you could pull that towards the sofa um, and, and have your food on there. I'll slide that back. Uh, on this sailing, we have a kettle because we're sailing out of the UK. So that's replenished uh, in terms of the tea, coffee and milk every day. And then below that, uh, one drawer there, but then your cooler, which is empty, um, except ours has got our complimentary bottle of wine and beer in there. And then a set of uh, four shelves, all self-closing. <laughs> a bit more there we go um and then this like table lamp which doesn't move it's fixed to that position yes so it won't fall off in this rocky weather we're yes, experiencing true. at the moment so if the uh if this video seems a bit shaky it's not me it's the weather we're at, uh, a bit of bumpy seas outside at the moment yeah um so then moving along we've had the beds made into twins um, so a very tiny shelving unit between each. Uh, you've got two bedside lamps, no reading lamps, just normal lamps. And the telephone there. And then if I move around here, great bit of storage above the bed. On both sides? Yeah, on both sides. Okay. So there is loads of storage in this cabin. Yeah, there is at the end of the day. Um, and then on this side, obviously, you've got the TV, which is fixed. It doesn't move, doesn't hinge out, nothing, because it's obviously facing the, the uh, beds. 
It's just unusual because sometimes you could sit on the sofa and what normally you'd expect to. Yeah, you'd expect angle to angle out, out. But this one doesn't seem to move. No, no. Um, and then to the balcony. Uh, well, the curtains here. I'm not. Well, I can pull them over, but you can see. They match the uh, lampshades. That's true. <laughs> yes, they do. Um, am I venturing out on here? Yeah, we'll try it. Um, we'll just. You can see some of it from here. It's quite a deep balcony with two yeah. chairs and a small table. We'll take you out. We don't know how badly the wind's going to affect uh, the, the sound quality, but we'll give you a look outside anyway. Listen to this. <laughs> it's not too bad. Cool. Try not to fall over. Yeah. So yeah, like I say. Yeah, so we've got the chairs uh, with footstools movable uh, reclining chairs and as always the tiny table yeah but we've not really had a chance to <laughs> enjoy the balcony this sailing so far i'm sure we will later but the seas uh, are calming down a little bit but yeah i'll just show you our view we're just sailing towards the azores um ponta delgada hopefully tomorrow i hope we don't miss it but we shall see um but that's uh you can just see an overall view of the cabin from here all in all Good. Very nice camera. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Thank you.